The cold months are dragging on and everyone's getting a little nostalgic for the summer. So I thought I'd make the berry fizz today on Wicked Cocktails. Hey, I'm Mike Holmes. I'm an owner and bartender at Wickman House, and today we're making the Berry Fizz. It's an incredibly fresh drink using blackberries, strawberries, raspberries, and to top it off, an egg white whip. So the Berry Fizz is a gin-based drink, and you want to use a nice drier gin. So a Plymouth, Brokers, uh, something along those lines. Simple syrup, fresh lime juice, fresh lemon juice, and then today we're going to be using raspberries, blackberries, strawberries, and an egg for the egg white whip. Alright, so the Berry Fizz is a little bit more of a labor intensive drink, but it'll really make your friends impressed. So, start with your mixing glass and your fresh berries. Um, I'm going to go two blackberries, three raspberries, and maybe, uh, let's say, six of these strawberries. I like strawberry a little bit better. I'm going to take your muddler and muddle these all down real nice. So you're going to want to make a nice uh, kind of a pulp out of it. So make sure they all kind of look the same, they're all matched the same way. And then I'm going to grab my gin and two ounces of gin. I like to rinse off my muddler with the gin and make sure I get all those berries there. So about two ounces of gin and now we're going to go simple syrup. Cut that real nice, so about three quarter ounce. You're gonna put all these fresh juices in there, maybe an ounce. So you're gonna put fresh lime juice and lemon juice, and that uses a, that's kind of a tartar flavor. So half ounce there of lime, half ounce of lemon, and we're gonna take our shaker, fill our pint glass with ice there, and just really shake it. You're going to want to pass all those juices around there. This is kind of making it um, almost like a smoothie there. So you're breaking it down even a little bit more with all those juices. So I'm going to take that, I'm going to crack this open and just kind of set it aside here. So there we are. And now this is where the labor intensive part really comes into it. So I'm going to take an egg and a copper bowl or any mixing bowl that you have, but we use a copper, it speeds things up a little bit. Just make sure it's a cold bowl. It'll, it's gonna take you a little while anyway. Crack the egg and separate the egg white. There you go. Set the yolk aside. You can use that for breakfast or not. Take your whisk and whisk it up. If you have the space or if you have the desire, you could also put it on ice the bowl while you're doing it. it kind of speeds things up a little bit here and as you see it's going to take me a little while to do this so and when the consistency kind of gets like meringue you know that you're done all right so i'm just going to set this aside here for a second and because i don't like to have a bunch of the the pulp and everything from the muddled berries i'm going to fill this glass up with ice big cubes as we like or crushed if you really want to get fancy and then i'm going to use a strainer to strain through. So just a regular, if you want a juice strainer, pulp strainer if you'd like, hawthorn strainer to get the stuff out of the mixing glass. Real nice pretty color there. And then I'm going to keep this here after it strains out because I want to use a little bit of that as some garnish. So we're going to keep that here. As you can see it's about three quarters of the way up, a little bit more. And you want to keep a little bit room because you want some soda water. So just a splash of soda water there. So then you're just going to put your egg white on top here. Real nice and foamy. Like I said, they can, you can drink it through the egg white, which is the correct, I, I believe, way to do it. It's a nice texture. Put a couple straws and then I'm just going to finish it with a blackberry here on top. And then I'm going to take a little bit of this pulp that's in here and just kind of confetti it over the top. An adult sundae here. All right, and there you have it, the Berry Fizz. Get this recipe and more at wickedcocktails.com. <laughs>